And welcome back, everybody. Time right now, 7.33. Join us from Longhorn Restaurant in Columbus. It's the chef and master griller. Haley has been on the show before. Thank you, Haley Petrock, mm -hmm. right? And then you brought along Brad, Brad yes. Cooper, who is also a grill master. Mm -hmm. And this morning we're talking about, we have a few weeks left of tailgating. I thought, come on, come on in and give us some tips on our, the last ditch attempts at doing a nice spread and you decided to bring in pork ribs, right? Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. Pork Tell ribs us. today. So I'm excited to be here because like you said, it's tailgating season and although Longhorn is known for our great steaks, we're also known for our fall off the bone baby back ribs. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to tell you how um, we prepare them and how you can prepare them at home. So over here, the first thing you're going to do is you're going to season it. Um, at Longhorn, we have a special seasoning that I can't share with you. However, can you give um, us an idea what's in it? Yes, at home you can do salt, pepper, um, garlic powder, and onion powder. And this is called a, a rub, right? Yes. This is where you're actually rubbing this in, Absolutely. as opposed to a barbecue sauce, which Absolutely. we'll talk about, right? Yes. So after you do that, you're going to um, put it meat side down. You're going to take a cup of water, pour it over um, the ribs, and you're going to cook that so it's slow roast at 325 for two and a half hours. Two and a half hours you yes. put it in there? When you say slow, what, what do you put the uh, oven on? At 325. 325 for two and a half for hours. Two and a half mm -hmm. hours. Wow, I did not know this. Yeah, okay. so they're going to be fall off the bone. You're, okay. You should be able to pull the um, meat off with a fork. Okay. So here's some that we've already have slow roasted. So if you're at home, you can use either a grill outside or you can use a grill pan. Mm -hmm. um, so here's some we have slow roasted. You're going to set it meat side down and you're going to take your barbecue sauce and you're just going to baste it over mm -hmm. like so. It's the basting process. Yes. You're yes. going to cook it on three minutes for three minutes on each side. So we'll let that cook a little bit. Um, you're going to turn it. Okay. So we're going to pretend. How long Absolutely. again on each side? Three minutes on each side. And what's the importance of which side you start with? Well, see, you want to start with the uh, meat side down to get that nice searing on the outside. Okay. Um, and then based on the opposite side. So mm -hmm. then you're going to baste on this side while the barbecue sauce is adhering to the back side of the ribs. Mm -hmm. So you get an even coat all the way around. All righty. More barbecue so sauce, the better. The more, th Brad says, the more barbecue <laughs> sauce, the better. I, I tend to be with you on that one. <laughs> if it's a good barbecue sauce, and yes. you guys provide, yes. you, create your own, right? We do. Yeah, we we do. Create you don't our use Kraft or no, Kroger's? No, absolutely not. We, um, ours is full of ingredients. So. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I joke. What have you got down here? Tell us what, you, what you've got down so here. So we brought some brisket nachos here today. Brisket nachos, yes. you say? Yes. Can you put barbecue? Nachos. Sauce on that? Absolutely. Oh, whatever you Brad want. Says, oh, yeah. <laughs> so that has our jalapeno queso cheese with a pico um, on top. And mm -hmm. then we have our new red, white, and blue cheesecake. Okay. That will be available next week. So it's a New York style cheesecake with blueberries and strawberries on top. And then we have our signature outlaw ribeye. It's a bone in 18 ounce ribeye, char grilled with some seasonal veggies. Yeah, that's my favorite Absolutely. cut of beef, the, the ribeye. And then also pairing with the, the this is a plate from Yes. Right? So this from will Longhorn. be the finished product here. Mm -hmm. And it's our um, baby back ribs with our steakhouse macaroni and cheese. Steakhouse and the macaroni cheese. More barbecue sauce. All <laughs> right. Well, with only a couple of games, at least Absolutely. in the, the regular schedule, mm -hmm. uh, here's some good tips relative to getting out and doing some barbecue. Absolutely. Right? Right. And That's if you'd right. rather leave the grilling to us, we'd love to see you at our restaurant. Uh-huh. Well, I want to come by and see you again. <laughs> it's always a pleasure seeing you. You guys do a great job. Doing Appreciate, that, it. Right? Appreciate it. I want to thank you so much for being here. Absolutely. Anything else before we go? We've got about 15 seconds. We're good. Thank you for having us. And like I said, if um, the grilling is a little too intimidating for you guys at home, you're more than welcome to come see us at the restaurant. All right. Thank you. Haley, Brad, thank you thank both. You.